hello traders it's your one and only for rescue coach team legend and i'm super excited to have you all here today on this one all right if this is your first time on my channel could you do me a little favor smash the subscribe button and turn the notification bell on so that you'll be the first person to get notified the moment that i release a new content because right here in this channel all we do is post strategies that help you win in the financial market be it boom and crash the volatility index or the currency pairs all right if you're new to forex all right and you want to know about how to trade the financial markets all right in our website we've got a free course for every new beginner who you don't have a knowledge about how to trade the markets but you want to belong to this wonderful industry and you want to start cashing out as others do cash out then we have a free course for you which is going to help you start up quickly in the financial market all you need to do is to go straight to our website the link is on the screen right now bullishbearfx.com and once you head to our website it's going to take you right here and here it says welcome to bullish bear forex academy all right so right here in our website we have quite a lot of courses that you can always enroll for to expand your knowledge be it for boom and crash or currency pair now what i want you to do since you're just a beginner and probably you don't have money to start up or you just want to see how does this market really work then you can go for our land forex for beginners as you can see it says enroll course so all you want to do is to click on it and once you click on it it's going to take you to register into the website once you register you can be able to assess all the free powerful content now here it says what will you learn you're going to learn introduction to forex how to create your forex trading account how to use the necessary apps you need for forex you're going to learn chart pattern candlestick patterns support and resistance price action analysis and more in this course all right so here are quite a lot that you have to uh begin to watch and learn how to trade the financial market you see a lot of them two hours courses three hour, uh one hour courses 15 minute courses a lot of them are here for you for you to actually begin your forex journey and i'm still loading more as time goes on you have quite a lot to start benefiting from even for free without paying a dime now what about the boom and crash traded uh trade like a robot we just completed the course a day ago and now it's at the rate of 30 dollars instead of 40 dollars that it used to be it's at the rate of 30 dollars and this course is going to help you learn the logics about boom and crash how to trade boom and crash like a professional even like a robot how to trade aggressively how to know where price will turn from how to know how to catch entries from sniper how to trade the market using the powerful logic of uh, uh, supply and demand and quite a lot you're going to learn you it wants you go through this course all right so you want to make sure that you don't miss out a single thing so let's get straight back to business now today in this video i want to show you how you can trade the boom and crash using simple support and resistance all right because we need to understand the support and resistance is a powerful tool for the boom and crash market. it's a very powerful tool for the boom and crash market so what you want to do whenever you get into the charts is you want to first of all zoom in all right when you zoom in you want to first of all check out where are the obvious supports and resistances in the market now you want to understand one logic about support and resistance and that is what the more touches you have on a support zone or on a resistance zone the weaker that that zone gets you know a lot of traders will tell you the more touches you have the better it is no i tell my students that's not it you want to understand that this support and resistance is just like a door all right which you keep banging the more you're banging the more you're banging that door keeps getting weak till it falls all right so that is what happens in support and resistance the more touches the more touches the more it gets weaker and that's why oftentimes you just notice the price can get to a certain zone and play and break the zone go up calms down break the zone again then the next minute you see it can hold the next you see when it comes back it breaks it again because of how many times it keeps touching so these are the logics you have to understand when it comes to plotting out your support and resistance and when it comes to trading your support and resistance so whatever you, what you want to do is you want to look for the fresh zones fresh support and resistance zones and use them to play your game 
all right so what we're going to do right now on this chart we can see clearly that so far so good we have this zone all right so how do you do that you want to focus on those zones that has been touched after a very long time you don't want to trade from those zones that uh that has been touched so closely when i mean so closely i mean let me give you an example you have an example like this you can see here he had a torch here and in the when it came to the future it broke through all right and in the nearest future not so far away we have so many torches so many torches all right so many torches not so far away so this zone is just not a good zone again but when you have a zone whereby you have the first the first torch here and after a long time you haven't seen any torch after a long time you haven't seen any torch i tell you that whenever price gets to the zone again it's going to hold all right another example we have here we had a touch here and after a long time it hasn't touched till when it came here and it held again now i want to tell you this if this price decides to come down from here right now if this price decides to come down from here instantly to the zone i'm not going to trade it because it's so close to this previous torch but if price continues to play around and play around and takes a lot of time and finally comes back far away one day i'm going to place it why because it's very far away so you want to only trade from those zones that price have not touched so many times and so closely all right so this is the things you need to understand about your support and resistance do not trade zones that are that have been touched several times and so closely okay now I hope you understand what I just explained concerning your support and resistance. If you understood it, please use the comment section and comment, I understood. All right. And if you didn't understand, you can just drop a question of what you didn't understand so that in my next video, I'm going to teach and talk about it more better. Make sure to like and subscribe. This encourages us to make more helpful videos in the future. Okay, so that's the simple logic of plotting your support and resistance. Currently now, this trade is in profit and I actually dropped it in the VIP signal and traders currently are in profit. All right, traders are currently in profit on this and we expecting that this price should go even higher to where we have the nearest resistance zone. Okay, to where we have the nearest resistance zone, which is actually here. So we're anticipating to take our TP1 somewhere around here. So we're expecting that this price should move higher. Now you might likely ask me, so Tim, why did you place the trade from here? Okay. Now actually you would notice that I had predicted uh, in the past, which was yesterday, I had predicted that when price gets here, it's going to move back up. Why? Because I had seen that after the first torch in the past, it has gone and took a lot of time. So I knew that whenever it comes back, it's going to hold. And that was why I drew this arrow here. All right. I took that screenshot and I actually sent it to the VIP telling them yesterday that that was what I was expecting here. Okay, I told them this is what I was expecting that anytime price comes back to this zone is going to hold and push back up. And this was the one hour time frame. So only for me to wake up this morning and I missed the move. This was the move here. You see, when it got there, that was where the move actually began. So now the question is, so Tim, why then did you buy again from the zone? The same thing applies to what I've just told you. I'm buying from the zone. Why? Because I can see clearly that this was where it held the last time on this same support zone and it had it had gone quite a lot of way all right when it came here it didn't hold now it broke through so i knew that it's actually going to hold again and that's why i called out the signal for traders so i'm expecting that this price should move all the way from here straight back up to the resistance that we have here so that's just the simple logic of trading using support and resistance in your uh chart trading the boom and crash so you need to understand these are simple logics when it comes to trading using support and resistance you know i know a lot of you'll be like tim no indicator today yes no indicator today this is purely price action using simple support and resistance but all you need to do is to make sure you, you understand the logics of support and resistance another thing that i use in trading is supply and demand and if you want to learn the logics because the logic is quite a lot but if you can take time and study you would understand it and i've taken time to teach my traders in the premium group how to use supply and demand 
to to know where the market turns from and how to trade it perfectly and that's why you have it on this course which says trade like a robot so you want to make sure you enroll and grab this course now that it's still at 30 dollars because this is actually the weekend promo all right and i've just posted it in my general telegram channel here so you want to also make sure you join us right in the telegram channel so that you don't miss out a single thing a single update or any of my free signals or analysis for the meantime traders make sure you stay safe keep learning keep practicing and keep winning